Hey everybody. Hello, welcome. everybody. Welcome, welcome, Hello. welcome. Rivals of Water Deep, season 13, episode six. Officially past the halfway point. Um, let's go around the table and introduce all of our uh, players. Uh, you can mention all your uh, character pronouns, all that cool stuff that we talk about every week. So let's start with Latia. It's me. I am Latia. And today I am playing Dahani, uh, everyone's favorite, um, slightly misguided Eric Okra monk. Uh, both of our pronouns are she, her. Oh, Masood. Hey everyone, I'm Masood. Uh, play Gozer, uh, Gozrik Nomrad, everyone's favorite socialist. Go Gozer! Gozer! Gozer, Gozer oh, just for this week. Oh, sorry, I left the bag slip about the new NPC. Sure. I, I gotta rewrite. <laughs> if a Gozer's in here, I gotta. Gozer's rewrite. in here. Uh, That's pretty awesome. Get some water, lubricate the whole vocal cords. Hey everyone, I'm Masudok, and I play Gozrik Nomrad, everyone's favorite socialist businessman, uh, detective, druid. And uh, both our pronouns are he him. I've had a very busy past couple of days. I uh, opened a show on Friday night Yay. that was very intense. And then Congrats. yesterday was Eid. Oh, so Eid Mubarak, to anyone who's celebrating. Yeah, Eid uh, Mubarak. And, yeah, Eid Mubarak. Yeah. Uh, I've been saying that wrong my whole life. <laughs> it was, now it's on, on uh, record. So we'll be able to have it. <laughs> uh, but that's me. Wait, Brian. Hi everyone, uh, I am Brian, I play Virgil, your Asimar Storm Sorcerer. Uh, my pronouns are he, they, Virgil's are he, him. Hi, uh, Eugenio. Hey everybody, uh, I'm Eugenio, uh, DM Jesians. I am very happy to be back, because uh, I missed uh, episode 5. Seems uh, Kent was busy trying not to get wet and searching for a lost <laughs> silver piece, uh, so thanks for that, y'all. <laughs> yeah. um, You're welcome. But I'm very back, uh, very excited to be back. Kent is back. Uh, Kent is our uh, tiefling phantom rogue, and both of our pronouns are he, him. And Tanya. I was a little thrown by that whole try not to get wet. Goodness. Uh, <laughs> uh, hi, I'm Tanya. I am your uh, human, as far as we know, paladin ranger with a little bit of barbarian in her for those John Wick moments. The skosh. Scotch. <laughs> and uh Sleeza's pronouns are mine or she her. That's right. Cool. And uh I'm sure if you're DM uh he him, uh also playing Shaka, he he him as well, and a variety of other NPCs um that we've seen come through. Um so why don't we start with talking about some of the uh Patreon goodness that we got uh going on. Uh so yeah, you know, why don't you uh, Yeah, yeah. Sit together. Yeah, let's do it together. Yeah, 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 no, sure. yeah. I mean, why not? To do no, it together? I'm completely yeah. unprepared, so obviously we're going to do it off the cuff perfectly flawlessly. <laughs> That's how we do. Um, so, Eugenio, did you yeah. know that we have a Patreon for Rivals of Waterdeep? <laughs> no shit. <laughs> yeah, and now is a fantastic time for everybody watching out there to uh, join, to start their support, or perhaps increase their support a little bit. And uh, what kind of things can they find on the Patreon, do you, oh, do you think? See, I hear all you have to do is go to patreon.com slash Rivals of Waterdeep, and you can get all kinds of cool shit like our after show that we record uh, for like half an hour-ish after every episode. You can find out what theories we have about the episode, what what Sharif deigns to share with us about the episode. Uh, you can check out that. Speaking of Sharif, uh, you can also get notes from him. I hear what other cool, cool things do we have for our patrons, Brian? Well, depending on the tier that you're supporting at, we are also doing, oh goodness, is it month? Is it quarterly merch? Quarterly merch. Uh, yes. I'm, I'm new to Patreon, so I'm still like making this up on the fly. <laughs> yeah, but, yeah, uh, but at certain, <laughs> certain tiers of support, you can get, um, you can get quarterly merch with our lovely, our lovely character art on it. Um, all kinds of merchandise like that. And yeah, I, I still feel like, and I said this last time, and I still feel like that $10 tier is really, you know, you're going to get your best bet. You're going to get our after show. You're going to get those DM diaries and you're going to get to hear about all the updates. But we always say that if you love what we do and you love seeing us and you want to support our lovely adventures continuing, uh, increasing your support is all, always something that we'd ask you to consider. Yeah, we talk a lot about what you all get from this, but like we should also say, hey, thanks, because your support <laughs> allows us to like keep doing this right and like Absolutely. we're all very high level now we've got a few more levels we hope to continue to do a few more seasons but you know there's all kinds of ideas that the rivals crew has for for rivals tm so all of that is only possible because of y'all support so uh you know you get cool shit we get to keep making cool shit i'm saying shit a lot today 
guess we're hitting that PG thirteen hard. I don't know what's happening. Okay, you only get one F. You only get one F word. So PG thirteen, just the one. Actually, I'm gonna throw that one to Tanya. Tanya can have that. Okay. What is the difference between PG thirteen and TV fourteen? Is it just? Is it like PG thirteen? You can say the F word. It's on TV. Okay, it's on TV. Is the difference? No, 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 no. But like, so I'm alone at fourteen. I can watch this, but in the theaters, I got to bring a parent if I'm. Yeah, TV TV fourteen can't do the F. TV M can do the F. Okay, okay, yeah, true. <laughs> All right, t- take it, Masood, before we... <laughs> oh, besides just our wonderful uh, sponsors on uh, Patreon who allow us to run, we also have uh, some great, great folks who sponsor all of us uh, at Rivals. And these are corporate sponsors that we owe a lot to. And so we just want to make sure we thank them as we get out of the gate. So we use D&D Beyond for all our digital character sheets and access to book content. Check out uh, them at dndbeyond.com. There's always a legendary bundle giveaway in chat, but you have to be here live for it. You can check that out going on uh, with the Nightbot right now. Um, If you're one of our uh, podcast listeners, come on by to the live show and see what shenanigans we'd up to. Um, And also be here for the giveaways. Our dice, trays, and vaults are provided by Wormwood Gaming. Uh, Use the code RIVALS for free domestic shipping at www www.wormwoodgaming.com we're also proud to be sponsored by die hard dice check them out at dieharddice.com and use the code rivals for 10 percent off um you get your geeky gear you need any sort of extra swag you can get that all from stormcrow go to shop.stormcrow.com rivals uh, on checkout to get 15 percent off as well my mug is currently out in the ether we'll see if it comes back to me um but in the meantime there are also a lovely list of quality goods available for y'all so go check them out and if you want to sound oh so silky smooth like the rivals crew use blue microphones go to crew.bluemic.com slash rivals and you can get some great gear and we get a little kickback from all your purchases and that's another phenomenal way to support us while also upgrading what you got um and if you're also looking for ways to support us by doing cool things on your own yo go play idle champions if you're not already by code name and entertainment type Exhalation code for this week's free Electrum chest. And don't forget to unlock Shaka, Selyse, the Dahani, Gosric, Pest, uh, uh, Fenris, uh, uh, Disco. And to get them all and complete the full Rivals crew, get all those stacking bonuses and really make it a superb way to play that game. Um, if you're looking for any other games to sort of set in the Waterdeep universe, check out War- Warriors of Waterdeep. You can type WOW Gems to get free gems in-game every week with our link. And if you want to know more about them, you can type WOW, uh, exclamation point, OS WOW to download and install Warriors on your mobile device. Um, we'd also want to give a shout out to uh, Voice Mod. If you're looking for a way to upgrade your um uh, production quality if you're podcasting if you're just dming at home if you're just i don't know want to add a little extra zhuzh to your next zoom meeting <laughs> check out voice mod uh, they got all the uh capabilities to make it really fun and add um some cool uh enhancement to already what's going to be a great time and that is all of our ads Wait, hey how, how, how do you spell zhuzh, how, how you zhuzh? Spell uh me I spell it J U J E. See, I think it's officially T. So no, T T J U Z E. Zhuzh. Oh wow! Oh, wow! No, I was gonna do Z H E. Yeah, no Z H U C H. Yeah, that was me. Yeah, interesting. Brian, Brian knows. He knows. Um. All right. So uh, now I hand it off to our whoosh captain, Latia. Me. All right. We've been gone. For two weeks. If you don't know or remember how to whoosh, you better remember. That's all I get to say. <laughs> you better remember. You better remember. You better remember. Oh, this is, I mean, <laughs> you better. You better. <laughs> you gotta kind of right, it though. If you don't remember, there it is. How there there it is. <laughs> remember immediately. <laughs> All right, everybody, get those whooshing apparatuses ready because we have to remember what happened two weeks ago previously on Rivals of Waterdeep. Yeah. All right, good whooshing. Two two weeks off, no problem. No problem for the whooshing. Flawless whoosh. Flawless whoosh. Flawless. No problem. (laughs) 
Um, all right, yeah, let's talk about episode five. Uh, you know, the halfway point of uh, the, the this season. Um, who wants to start off with uh, what hit them? What they remember? What is their th- their highlights? What hit us? Uh, Nothing hit us. It's been two weeks. You want us to remember that? I... Oh yeah, everything. Point by oh point. yeah. Okay. Well, let's jump into it, folks. We hop back in right after a scramble with some guards. Uh, the one guard that was left, we try to interrogate some information from. Um, and got a little bit of knowledge that this person was very scared of whoever was in charge, uh, uh, even more so than us, which is terrifying because they were <laughs> impaled by Salisa's sword during yeah. this moment. Uh, it's, it's surprising. We were, we were all shocked. Uh, Gosrick summoned a spider, which we had to uh, confirm was, in fact, small. So what did that yeah. mean? Uh, <laughs> yeah. What was his name? Skip, Skipper? Scudder? Skipper. 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 Yeah. Skipper. Skipper will be yeah. back. Uh, and <laughs> no worries. No worries. No. Just like a familiar just goes back to wherever familiars go. Uh, yeah. yeah, yeah. Um, and then we dealt with um, some puzzles on the way to, well, just out of where we were. This is sort of... Uh, Almost hang hang on, I'm gonna I'm gonna do this part because I yes, just please. watched yes, the episode please. and yes. I thought this was really really clever. Um, after you questioned this guy, you all headed out and tried to like you realized that you were in this weird labyrinth where a lot of the barriers were invisible to you. Mm-hmm. And yeah. Gosric had the really brilliant idea, I have to say, uh, props to you, sir, uh, you you. of casting tidal wave. Uh, to watch where the water flowed to identify yeah. where the invisible barriers were. Uh, very cool. Uh, and so that led you all uh, mm-hmm. through the invisible labyrinth mm-hmm. and to a door. <laughs> we smashed. <laughs> we, okay, we broke. With, yeah. a, with yeah. a seemingly fake doorknob that just <laughs> completely melted y'all's brains. <laughs> <laughs> the fact <laughs> that the doorknob didn't turn short-circuited everyone. You know, I mean, how I just, I honestly, I'm just going to start making a public appeal for DMs to stop giving parties doors. Okay? No, no doors. From now on, they're all going to be the supermarket one that just as you approach, it slides open and you'll walk because I swear. No, because see, oh. then somebody's going to walk in front of it and it won't open and that's going to be then our brains will melt again. I Because like it has a moonbeam juice on it and that's exactly. how we know they're a doppelganger. Exactly. See, yeah. I do love this idea of open concept dungeons, you know, no, yeah. no doors. Like you can see High everything ceiling. from the kitchen. Yeah, oh, yeah. No. Oh, it was bad enough in the real workplace. Oh, no. <laughs> can I ask you guys something? Uh, and Please. Just, it, it, either as God's or as myself, but after, <laughs> after that episode, I went online and I saw a targeted ad for a mobile game which involved literally filling mazes with like liquids. And I was like, can I sue? Is this, is this, is this a thing? <laughs> they like, because someone was on it so fast. Rivals fam? Come on. Who did? Let, dude, let me. No, yeah, no, no. We will get the, like, um, we'll get the licensing, okay? Who, who, who was so to add that quickly? <laughs> yeah, um, right? We, we found a door and then we, we kind of wrenched the fake doorknob yes. off. But, Which was very funny because you all didn't describe this, but I imagined with Salisa's, I think like very high roll, it was either dirty 20 or potentially a natural 20, mm, uh, to, to, uh, to pull on the door. <laughs> yeah. And I just imagined Salise going ass over tea kettle as this knob comes off of this door, <laughs> which is not what happened. But since I wasn't there, I was able to imagine it however I wanted. And that's yeah, yeah. That funny. But did you watch it? No, but it was a 20. I mean, it was yes. Like a full, but, it would have been a full. You know, so make sure you always, oh, yes. always brace before opening any door. You know, right. like, brace. Yeah. Um, um, now I'm just but, going to keep doing this. But, there was a mis- <laughs> you know, but the fact that we removed the doorknob, uh, there was an opportunity to, mm-hmm. to look through the yes. the hole left behind and in the space Dahani. Uh, well, we all, we all kind of clocked the shimmering, shining, and splendid. Yeah. I'm not going to sing it. I'm not going to do it. Um, no, don't do it. But Dahani had the idea because Dahani now has experience of touching ghostly, sparkly things to basically just touch it. Yep. And poof. And poof, she was ghostly again. I was um, ghostly again. Yeah. And, and so you uh, all found yourselves back. This I this I was not sure of. You found you were we were in water deep when we fought the guards. Yeah. And correct. then as everyone touched the shimmy, <laughs> shimmery, yes. just Ooh. leave out a syllable. Why not? Shimmy, shimmy y'all. Uh, <laughs> As everyone touched the shimmy, shimmy uh, we, you all were back then in 
Strix we're back, back, on, we're back other... on the way. Yeah, we're okay. Back. Okay, that's okay. Right. Yeah. yeah, but I, I yeah. will not leave out the fact that while while the honey once again figured this out very quickly and was waiting on us because after <laughs> yeah. touching and going ghostly, yeah. the door no longer existed. The honey once we figured it out because you know we're very quick, we're mm -hmm. very very smart and very very quick. Dahani is back there, just like rocking out, like just doing the yeah. doing a bird dance, like a victory, like yep. <laughs> <laughs> but we did find ourselves. We found ourselves back in Strixhaven, um, on the on a a corridor towards Quandrix, and uh, right. Loreen and Javanesh were uh, were giving us the heads up on like gonna see some weird stuff. Gonna, yeah. find, you know, Javanesh is basically our guide because we might get lost or fall into another dimension or I don't know, whatever happens at like Strixhaven. I love my moments of brilliancy last episode because I said, I crushed that puzzle. And then I was yeah, like, oh, did. Javanesh, Javanesh, our leader, our, uh, our tour guide, oh, yes. our, our protector. Remember. I'm going to give you foresight, dude. Oh, yeah. yeah. An eighth level spell. Yeah. My <laughs> only eighth level spell slot. I'm going to give it to you. And I want you to protect us because it's going to be fractals, theoretical, like, Places MC Escher come to life, Ooh. and I want her to be prepared for whatever is coming her way. It was and then Javanesh left. <laughs> One hundred percent, just dipped. Just left us. Um, yeah, I did. I did like that. Yeah. After the awesome, oh goodness, who said which airport was it that has like the like? Oh, it reminded me of the Epcot. Yeah, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, on your way yeah. It reminded me of, like the Epcot back in the day. But yes, so oh, we yeah. got we yeah. went through this like you know basically like an old school Star Trek time travel type warp tunnel thing. And um, goodness, wait, no, brain was going to do it. Uh, yes, yeah, so we found all of the, we, we basically were there and it was awesome, except um, it wasn't what we expected to find. Mm -hmm. uh, there were little fractals everywhere. So yeah, many yeah, it was, it was, yeah, it was, it, it was the camp. It was the camp. It was the Quandrix school on Strixhaven's campus. Yeah. So they were like moving walkways. There were these weird like geometrically shaped waterfalls. Um, but yeah, you, you just saw a bunch of fractals that weren't moving yeah. uh, when you got there and you didn't see any students. That's what you saw when you first got there, yeah. And, oh, then... and Lorene learned not to rely too much on the generation gap when talking to Celise. <laughs> oh yeah, that was great. Um, yeah, she, uh... yeah. So. As I recall, you all discovered little things uh, on the fractals. Like mm -hmm. one of them had glasses, uh, <laughs> and yeah, one of them had like that a rolled... backpack or something. Y yeah, there was somebody that rolled pretty high. I forgot who, but like uh, yeah. someone basically mm -hmm. noticed. Oh yeah, it was it was uh, it was the honey, mm -hmm. um, and yeah. So like y'all basically noticed that these fractals, these mascots, you know, look like they were students right they had mm -hmm. backpacks they had you know class and mm -hmm. stuff um and it seems yeah. to be the deans of quandrix that are experimenting and doing this to the students that's what allegedly yeah yeah you, you uh uh i believe masood uh undid i forgot what you cast but you cast i was just i <laughs> didn't need to bring a restoration i think mm -hmm. i am looking at my spell slots i think that's what i burned um so yeah, it was yeah well, i'm also yeah. running out of spell slots which makes me a little <laughs> yeah. scared yeah. Yeah. so we brought yeah. lorene basically recognized like you know we basically yes. asked lorene like hey right. is there someone you know who would always be wearing something and she called out her friend who's an elf but is also like a a a longbow cross player cosplayer yeah like not really but it's just like i just you know he just likes doing the thing mm -hmm. yeah and brought restored him for a minute mm -hmm. got some info we're told that we should leave yeah and and then then poor 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 kid went back to being a fractal mm -hmm. yep yep that, <laughs> Very fast. that was kadoris yes yeah of course um, thank you yeah yeah so i guess at the end of the episode like the choice was do you stay and go toward the uh tower where the deans where they normally are at the risk of this spell affecting you yeah um mm -hmm. or 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 bounce like that was kind of the the uh should we decision stay or should we go and i know it's mm -hmm. a very, it's a surprising surprising decision i know our decision is extraordinarily shocking but given the choice of going back home or running headlong into potential danger we all obviously decided to go back home. So Sharif, I don't know what you're going to do. Yeah, exactly. oh, definitely well, our vibe. Yeah. Well, I will say it, it wouldn't technically be just bouncing from everything. It would be like going, you know, like uh, going back and uh, 
speaking to people that you already have, like to Tully or to, you know, other folks to get more information. So, sure, 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 sure. I mean, y'all could go back home and I say mean, it's a, and I, look, Shaka is a very episodes. experienced adventure at a very <laughs> high right. level. I'm very sure that he can handle it. Like, it we yeah. would leave a note explaining our situation <laughs> and it would be great. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah, yeah. So, um, yeah, so I mean, that's where we are, y'all. Um, I mean, we are uh in front of little uh cadors with refractalized um you know and uh y'all are standing here so what what do we do okay well i feel like we should know which one, like at least head towards the dean it sounded like this happened to everybody all at once. Yeah. Do we feel anything, Sharif? Like, do we like? Is there a noticeable like effect that we are feeling in terms of this transformation? Uh, you can you can do an Arcana, do an Arcana roll. See what you mm, can. Uh, okay. <laughs> oh no. Oh, okay. This is yeah. terrible. This is seventeen. Okay. Um. Yeah. I mean, you feel like this was. Be, because it's affecting like a large area that this would you get the sense that this is likely um the result of some experiment gone haywire oh, um, oh yeah. no uh, sh sh just kind of a sense that th th that that th that you get okay that's both better and worse mm -hmm. uh, <laughs> mm -hmm. okay all right mm -hmm. Yeah, and 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 yeah, as as like uh, as, as you guys are talking, like Lorene kind of points toward this sort of massive tower, um, sort of in the middle of this campus, mm -hmm. and like I says, well, I mean, Taurus Hall is is usually where the deans reside. I haven't been in there in a very long time now. Will anyone stop huh? us? That part. Oh, that's yes. interesting. Um, I mean, there's usually, you know, upperclassmen and prefects and such. Um, but I mean, I don't recall. Usually you can just walk in and you know, if mm. if someone doesn't want you to see anything, they just kind of shut their doors. Um, and there's usually some kind of magical lock and such on yeah, them so you can't get in. But well, we're not going uh, in people's doors. Fair enough. Like it's not a are. not a sock, they don't put a magical sock on the door. Quick <laughs> 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 um, mage sock. Um, but no, we yeah. should. Well, well, I'm just mentioning that because the deans, I mean, they normally are like in their offices, you know, mm -hmm. uh, sure, sure. arguing sure. about some formula or something yes. here and there. Um, oh. Okay. I feel, I, I feel fairly confident that based on this, what we've heard and what the the the, the guard at the back said, being more afraid of of them, I feel like that's what we should check out. Mm -hmm. Yes, and also. I think I hate to say it, but any prefects or upperclassmen, I think are cons are these are these things now. So everything is fractals. Everything is fractals. <laughs> um. So I, uh, Gazer, wants to like just take a look at one of these uh, constructs now. And like, they were once human, right? They were once flesh, and now they're something else. Can I like? I mean, they weren't like... human. They were a mix of different. Uh, sorry, sorry, sorry. Yeah, uh, yeah. yeah humanoid, but... non human... yeah, yeah, yeah. They were not. They were not made of uh, mass. Just raw, like yeah, mass. <laughs> they were not. What is this? <laughs> granite? Is this a granite fractal I come across? Like, oh yeah. my god, no. Uh, oh. But there, there, there's at some point a flesh of some kind. I imagine for some folks, and I just want to. Can I like analyze, like just looking oh. at it, if there, if there was like a trick, like I like it. the transformation, or like, like I want to, yeah. So you want to see like what exactly are you looking? I just want to, I just want to like analyze one of them and try to see if I can see the trace remnants of the magic that was like the spell that like forced them to become this, or like what's making it happen. Oh, I think I want okay. to, as Gazric, just cards on the table. If we're gonna slowly become fractals, 
would rather have the ability to wild shape into one. If I can understand, if, if like I as, as a druid, can I wild shape into one, retain my mind oh. and like have that ability wow. to like move forward. But well, yeah, that's so just like if that that's the most thing. Yeah. I will say that uh, you can wild shape into one. Okay. But without doing that. Okay. Um, but there might be a role to see how successful you look exactly like one of these. So you might look like a you know, mm. like a ah. like a messy looking fractal. Sure, 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 sure. Uh, you you <laughs> might look lo like exactly like Gosric, just with just, some in, just like fractals, just some yeah. squares on your face. Oh. <laughs> uh, Oh, wild shape, horrifying. wild okay. shape into PlayStation graphics. Yes. <laughs> yes. Yeah, exactly. You just, turn, you just turn into eight bit Gazer. Yeah. Um, oh no. Please, um, I'm loving it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So, so yeah. Uh, if 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 you want to watch it, into I'm sure. Yeah. Um, but uh, but like I'll have you roll to see how, like how, how successful how, how successful it is. Okay. I uh, I'll give it a shot. Um, what would I roll for this? Is this a nature one? Is this like arcana what, what do you think survival uh i'll say survival can work arcana can work okay um not not nature but okay like either, either of those <laughs> can work for sure. well i will go with survival because i have a plus 11 and i trust that this nice. <sighs> okay 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 <laughs> I just saw you like steady yourself. It, was a, it, was, it felt like, like a good, it felt like this All is right. going to be a good roll. And I, want, I <laughs> okay. either get really good rolls or ones. And I feel ah, like yeah. I'm just like, I feel this that. one can't be a one. Uh, this one is actually in the middle. It was a 12 plus 11, though, because survival. 23. 23. Okay. Um, yeah. Uh, so I'll say then that you basically have, that's definitely a great role. So you can basically not only wash it, but you can like, choose what it looks like okay so like you can choose like what the features are so if you want to be like one with uh you you you, you can basically accessorize yeah your oh boy your uh your uh fractal so like so like what do you want this fractal to look like oh this I'm, I'm looking at the fractal monster right now and they and like of, also yeah also remember, remember that they can vary in size so yeah you can, yeah uh, you <laughs> can uh, yeah, you can you have some flexibility here. This is perfect. Um, I'm going to change into a, a like I look I see that they look like uh snakes kind of. Yeah. yeah and I kind of lizard wanna move it more towards like a salamander. So I still have like Ooh. like two hands because I, I in case I want to cast any like simple spells or anything like that, I want to have the ability to and feet. Um just for that ability. Uh, and then my face just kind of turns, just kind of elongates. Like I anamorph a little bit into it. And like the hat kind of also shifts and like becomes part a little bit more down um, as like my ears sort of full back. Uh, still keep the beard. So kind of look like a bearded salamander. Okay. Interesting. Right. Beard. What? Uh, are you blue? Yeah, yeah, yeah of course. Blue? Okay. Yeah. So of course. Of up. course. I gotta make sure. <laughs> yeah. Got a story. Um, okay. Great. Are you? Uh, mm -hmm. Are you attempting to look like a student, or are you just like this is? I just want to be a fractal specifically. Like, are you? I think it's. I, I want to retain some of the personal things okay. I have, and maybe make if my arms are small enough, like hide them or like if, if okay. someone if someone have to look to see me, but yeah, I'm going to stay small for now. I'm going to stay okay. uh, like, okay. and just sort of like stick with the group. Do you, do you tell the rest of the party what you're going to do? I was about to ask. Do it or I was like, about to ask this because yeah. the reaction is about to be very interesting. Uh, <laughs> I, just, I think, I think we're like, we're, we're in and they're like talking about the tower and stuff. I'm like, oh, great. And I look over at this one that just turned and I just do it. I think, I think oh just my like God. transforms and then like walks back up to the group. It's like, all right, we're ready. We're good. We have to leave. We're all going to turn into these things. What is, no, 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 Wait, no, 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 no. What is going on? No, 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 no. It's all good. I, 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 I chose this. This is, this is, see, now, if something happens to you all, <laughs> you'll be able to know. We'll be able to have a base model to compare to as transformations occur. I'm still good. I'm still ready. You know, I can still do my stuff. Because uh, I'm now 18. And I gain the ability to uh, 
Is it, is it features and traits? Is that 18? 18. I can uh, beast spells. I can cast druid yeah, spells. Spell spell yeah. 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 So our yeah, first yeah. steps towards complete apotheosis because 20th level druids are immortal. Right. Exactly. <laughs> uh, um, and so, so I just, yeah, cast a quick like gust and like make some like wind move. I was like, yeah, I still got it. It's so good. We're ready. So Salise is just like not believing this at all. <laughs> She's like, you're fooling us. No, 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 no. She's gonna like poke at him just very gently yeah. with like the tip of her sword. Yeah. If you're I really Gosric, do you bleed? <laughs> what what's happening? We do not poke our friends with swords. I don't what? think I'm not sure if fractals bleed. No. <laughs> no, that's a good question. Yeah. I mean, do I just chip might, him a little bit? No. He might chip. <laughs> yeah, it'll be like a little, it'll be a little chip. Yeah. Little, little, little. Uh, that care rating has gone down just like that. Okay. Uh, I don't I don't think it would hurt Gazric though if it's just a little poke. Just 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 a little chip on it. It's not like I just went I'll take <laughs> one point of damage. I'll take one point of damage just as to me. And I'm just like so how f- we turn our back and now you're a fractal? This is to get ahead of it. This is to be ready in case like really. And now I'm gonna take some time, I'm gonna get used to this body. And if something starts happening to you all, I'll be able to react a little faster um, to prevent it. Because if, look, if this thing is trying to eliminate us and turn us into one of them, hey, double agent time, right? We got secret agent gods right here. Do it. I won't do it. I won't do it. Mm-mm, mm-mm. Do it. We should do it. No, I'm not <laughs> saying the name. No, Gazric. No, <laughs> No. All right. well, okay. You know. Well, this is all on word. <laughs> yeah. Please. Our, our, I don't want to think just... about this any longer than I have to. <laughs> and and Faye is very curious about this. Yeah. Oh, I'm sure. Yeah. She keeps poking you randomly with her finger. Are you? Oh, <laughs> I, I still feel what? things. Well, no, she's just touching with her finger. You probably hurt her feel. because <laughs> you're a fractal. I do look sure. Oh yeah. All yeah, right. I got flat I, parts though. Yeah, I imagine Fem- Femris might be barking at you as well because you're just Femris is growling. <laughs> you don't know who he is. Femris is like, uh, where's the short dude that that pets me on occasion? Mm-hmm. Yeah. I try to look right. in his eyes. Let's do it. She okay. growls right. at you. So, um So are we going to where Taurus Hall? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Is is uh Gazric, uh I guess keep uh, up with us, you know. Yeah, yeah. I uh, hop on a, a Virgil's shoulder. I like climb him up, and I'm like just sitting there. How okay, where are you? you? You're I'm perching small. on. I'm, oh, okay. Okay. I can I can okay. diminish an aug. Right, I can. Oh, yeah, yeah, like yeah. yeah. This day gets, yeah, gets more fascinating. Oh, I can even be tiny. Yes. Oh yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah, 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 yeah. Oh yeah. You, yeah. Can, you, you can vary from tiny to. I don't think you can get colossal, but you can get large. You yeah. yeah, yeah. Oh, I'll be tiny for now. I'll just be like, pop up there. I'm like, oh, this is fascinating. You know, it's wild. My voice actually does get higher as I get smaller. I think it's a shortening of the vocal cords. Great. As you dig your claws into, Vir- into uh, Virgil Schoeder, um, we continue up to Taurus Hall. Okay. Great. Do, 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 do. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. And, 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 and of course, there there's like a music as you're walking. Yeah, um, yeah. So um, you you uh, you 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 I get to this really big open door, you know, kind of like a really tall op- op- open door, um, and you see a bunch of steps, mm-hmm. um, kind of like going upwards, almost like it looks like almost to no end, almost. Um, you can tell that, that they s- s- start to spiral a little bit, um, but it's just a huge set of steps going uh, up. Um, and then, like uh, Lorene says, I don't remember those steps being there when, when, when I last went here. Oh. How else did you get up there, though? Uh, I don't know, I guess. Oh, wait. Wait, I I think most of the time I was like only on the first floor, I guess. Okay. Um, but 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 it still looks strange. It does. Well, how how far up is it? How far do we have to go up? Well, I mean, the deans are at the top, of course. You know, so that they can they oversee are. everything. All right. Uh, GM, how far is it? I mean, like they have the penthouse. <laughs> penthouse. <laughs> What's 
it needs to be fewer than how many feet, Virgil? Yeah, is it is it, is it like where, where we're going? <laughs> it's uh yeah yeah this this thing is is pretty tall. Um, okay. You, you you don't know the, you don't know the exact height of it, but if if you had to guess, like it's like you know several stories tall. This thing would be mm. if it, no. if there's stories in water. <laughs> Look, we are not going to come up with units of measurement for everything in water. It's, it's, it's the water deep story. This is the water deep story, all right. I guess now it's a it's a strict saving story, but whatever. Yeah. Um. Yeah. Okay. Virgil like looks up and uh, fine, and just rubs his hands together and starts to move them a little bit further apart. And you can kind of see like there is a little, there's a little almost visible ball of wind kind of forming between them. And he flexes his fingers down and, and there is this massive gust um, amongst everyone's feet. Ooh. And uh, everyone now has uh, a flying speed of 30 feet for one hour. Um, I did not give it to Dahani, but I gave it to Loreen in case she wants to come with us and Faye. So, Essentially, I can choose. Let's see, one, two. Yeah, I can choose seven creatures within thirty feet. So that's that's everyone. Yeah, um, I love it. So, so yeah, essentially. Pardon? Do I have to carry feathers? <laughs> no, yeah, no, no, I'm on. That's I, I hop down I'm... and just raise my size a little bit. I was like, "Come on, bud!" <laughs> oh my gosh, that. Well, I didn't. Well, God, I mean, if you, are you not on the shoulder then? Because no. sure, that's fine. Oh, yeah. Am I? Am I no. one of set? Am I? Can I fly? Am I one of? Yeah, you are. Yeah. yeah. This is, this is just, yeah. counts as a, as a seventh. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Harris would be yeah. seventh. Yeah. yeah. Also, yeah. I figured Salise is strong. Maybe maybe a, a cuddle puppy on the way up. Right. You know, like I have no just, idea what how a how a wolf or other canid would refer would like react to all of a sudden being whoosh. Well, yeah. Imagine it. This is an absolute. This is an absolute like callback. But I imagine it similar to the Disney Peter Pan cartoon when <laughs> the when Nana starts flying, but she's still attached to her doghouse, so she starts to float, and wow, it's very awkward and for, real. for a moment. Yeah, yeah. Wow. yeah. I will also um, say I don't want to get too far off, but it's also us. So I there's a series like a four episode series on Netflix about like pets, and in one of them, this dude like parasail not parasails. Uh, what is hang it? We jump off a cliff and you have a hang, <gasps> not hang glide. He's got the oh, parasail. Oh, right? yeah. Hair gliding. Hair gliding. Hair gliding. Hair gliding. Oh. Uh, or parasailing, whatever that is, with yeah. his dog. Oh and my the god! Dog loved it. Oh, oh, I'm sure. So, um, so yes, we don't have to walk up the stairs at this point. We're 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 just we're taking the slightly more express route because everyone that can just fly. Good. Yeah, yeah. Good. And Virgil knows that you're all familiar with flying, with the possibility, possible exception of Phaenris, because he has heard about the uh, the dragon fight. <laughs> all right, Let and can me... can just deal with it. <laughs> I just deal with it. I love that. Uh, I'm gonna roll for Lorraine because uh, she yes. is definitely not familiar with it. And I want to, uh, I'm just not used to having a physical four when I fly. I usually turn yeah, into a yeah, and that's another right. thing is like Virgil did not ask at all. <laughs> <laughs> he, looked, he looked up and was like, "Nah, uh-uh. yeah, well, yeah, 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 wow, yeah." Yeah, leg now, day when, never. Now, when they get this gust, is it like they can fly, or it like starts to move them up? No, know? no, no. They are they they have the ability. Everyone it's now the has the ability okay. to fly. And after Virgil did this, and the gust happened, Virgil just slowly rose off the ground and started looking at y'all like, "Okay, okay. <laughs> yep. oh my god, what? Faye loves it. She's like mentally calculating the wind speed and wh- how she can do this mechanically now." Mm-hmm. No, yeah. she's gonna build herself some wings. Mm-hmm. Wangs. No one said oh, she hasn't. Wangs. Um, <laughs> yeah, L- L- Lorene also loves it, though. It does take her some time <laughs> to steady herself. Fair enough. Um, mm-hmm. Like, if you, since we're mentioning uh, other shows, like, if you think about when, like, uh, Iron Man was first starting to fly and he came oh, with the. <laughs> yeah. Like, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So, like, so she's wobbling around a bit, but, but, like, she does. Uh, get, get her uh get, get her uh steadiness up nice. and uh yeah yeah everyone's able to just sail up um which is uh great uh avoiding all those wonderful traps on the stairs that's great uh, uh traps on the stairs that's great. that's great uh maybe uh yeah <laughs> we'll never yes. 
Yeah, you'll never know. Um, I take that or, as a yes. I just or they didn't want be, a montage. I'm like, let's or, go. Or they, <laughs> might be, or they might be moved somewhere else. It'd be great. Yeah. Uh, uh, yeah. So, yeah. So, um, are you guys heading straight up, straight up to the top where yeah. uh, Lorraine mentioned that the deans would be? Yeah. Or like, are you heading? Yeah. Like, look, I mean, because 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 like i mean you're passing a ton of different floors yeah. of course i want to look as we like essentially I, I assume all of us are just kind of scoping things out as we go up because yeah. lorraine mentioned that there would be other people other offices yeah, yeah. are are does it, essentially does it look normal like is there a random selection of opening closed doors or yeah so if you look you do see some open doors okay and mm -hmm. you see that there are regular looking students okay good in these doors and regular oh. looking like professors okay. so it looks very different than it did on the outside where everyone was these kind of frozen fractals inside of here it just looks like a regular you know and and and, and like a lorraine even mentions it like yeah i'm surprised this looks pretty I much going, how i remember it pretty i normal. was going to ask is this is are these floors are they like the um the inn the tavern are they set somewhere else? Do these doors open to some other place? Uh, I don't. Oh. I don't think so. Oh. Uh, as I said, I haven't been here in a little while, but yeah. uh, as far as I know, that's something that they were only trying with uh, the tavern. So this um, this is Strixhaven. Yet these students are unaffected by whatever has befallen those on the campus. Yeah, I think so. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and and like I don't, I'm, I mean, like, do you see any of that, uh, any of that uh, weird shiny stuff? I don't see any around. So yeah, I think I, I think we're good. Okay. okay. I'm still gonna stay as a fractal, just for me then. <laughs> <laughs> of course, it's, yeah. you know, infiltration, subterfuge. It's yeah, absolutely, absolutely. Um, yeah, is, yeah. And and uh, as as you're going up 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 as well, you do see other individuals floating up and down as well mm -hmm. um so so like you're not really attracting much attention because it looks like oh. this is like a common way for people that want to avoid the stairs and have an hour of flight uh -huh. it's only the, wants to the avoid first the years have like, to use all the stairs nobody yeah. wants yeah. to take the stairs that's like hazing stuff no. yeah <laughs> to, to like navigate this uh yeah. tower so um yeah, yeah. So, like, uh, that's uh, one thing that you notice is that everything looks normal huh. in terms of the people that you would expect to see. Um, th there are some closed doors, but there's some sure. open doors. There's sure. some people that are walking around. Um, yeah. So. All right. No, no fractals up here, and no one's taking any odd notice of us. Just mm -mm. on, on, upward Word. towards the top. Yeah. Okay. Sweet. Okay. Yeah. So sail, 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 sail up um so you reach the top um and uh virgil doesn't stop the spell you bang your heads against the ceiling and eventually go there now um, willie will walk charge up after us, like no, hurting the ceiling. Ceiling. he's gonna like we're gonna damn it he's gonna get billed at the end for that now dang it yeah and then you hit your heads and then fall straight down oh, yes done. No. <laughs> we're all done thanks everybody in this moment and you have to put them back together <laughs> oh, <no. Terrible> pieces. <laughs> Um, terrible no. cliffhanger where we're just mid fall and yeah. episodes over. Uh, music uh, starts playing. It's great. No, no. Every, 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 everyone makes a very graceful landing yeah. onto the uh, topmost uh, floor. Um, and here you do see all the, all the, you know, you're the, 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 you know, you know, this is like a tower, so it's like a big mm -hmm. cylinder, right? Mm -hmm. So, mm -hmm. so like uh, you like, do see all the doors here are all locked. Mm. um and there's about, any... go ahead huh? no, no no go ahead oh and, and uh there's there's like about eight of them basically mm. it's about eight of them and they're all locked are any of them mm. sort of conspicuously uh, uh marked more ornate or marked or bigger yeah. or shimmering or of the of or, or shimmering shim yeah shimmying shimmying shim <laughs> I'm going to take care of the shimmying. dean's office, yeah. but also if they're shimmering, we should know yeah, that. Yeah. He's We're like, shimmying. Kenton's absolutely shimmying uh, oh, yeah, for I some mean, reason. Uh, and bouncing. <laughs> uh, <laughs> um, yeah, you definitely see two doors 
um, that definitely look a lot more ornate than the others. Mm-hmm. Um, one door has a big K on it, and one door has a big I on it. Uh, okay. And and like a and like a Lorene says, oh yeah, that's definitely for Ken and uh, mm-hmm. Im- Im- Imbraham for sure. Are the other doors marked in any way to indicate like if they're no. somebody's offices? No. Okay, great. No, no, they all just look like regular doors, but uh, th- these are two look the fanciest. Okay. Mm-hmm. Well, I, I mean, <laughs> Lorene, who would who would I don't have you ever interacted with either of the deans directly? Um, I mean, they welcomed all of us at the commencement, and they made us. Okay. They started singing at stupid Strixhaven song and expecting us to know at our first day. It was kind of weird. Um, <laughs> let, let, like they handed out all these sheets and they were like, sing the song. And we were like, whatever. Um, and, you know, we kind of hummed along. Um, but no, the deans, um, I mean, I guess when you're in higher level classes, like they probably teach it or whatever. Um, but, you know, like I'm kind of in those like uh, those uh, big those uh, big intro classes, you know, where everybody uh, kind of sure. takes them and you like you don't really see the higher level Sure, uh, sure. Teachers. Mm-hmm. So I kind of hear about them through their uh, reputation, uh, which is pretty tough. Mm. Um, okay. You know, um, That's good to know. Uh, but I do know that uh, you usually have to, uh, you know, uh, book an appointment to see them. Mm-hmm. Um, okay. But I just haven't really done that. Um, and as she says that, um, uh, you sort of see um, sort of in front of the doors. Uh-huh. Just like just like materializes um a fractal. Uh uh so just a re- you know, just like a regular looking fractal. Uh nothing uh uh strange about it. Doesn't look like a student at all. Um does have glasses and like a clipboard. Um and like I says, Hello, uh do you have an appointment? How are wow. you holding how are you holding that clipboard? people that kind of uh, thing <laughs> I'm, I, I'm holding it like this and then they just kind of you know have have these little arms and oh. then say oh uh any other questions <laughs> would uh, you like to ask you? How, how i breathe or how i eat or uh, how i walk and that's actually a little deserved okay mm-hmm. so yeah that's yep. that's fair okay just sort of appreciate but typical Hmm. Uh, no. Do you, oh no! Do you have an appointment? Oh no! We oh. Can I intimidate the fractal? You, you can try Didn't to answer know. fast enough. Yeah. <laughs> what? One of us has never tried to get into a club. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> oh. You can try. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. A velvet the... rope. The bouncer. No, I mean, what if okay. there was outside oh, the door? I'm more that. thinking about that super capable <laughs> admin in every anime. Yeah. Like, yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah. So, <laughs> out quickly, out of character, does anyone want to try something before Salish just tries to intimidate her way in? Yeah, I, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I can handle I mean, this I, how you want. Yeah. I was like, are you aware that all of your students in the in the oh. not in the, not in the tower are fractals? That's kind of a big thing, and we want to know why. So no, we don't have an appointment, but it's kind of an emergency. Mm-hmm. Uh, all the students are fractals outside. What are you talking about? Have you looked outside? Can you even see outside from up here? I work here. I don't get to go outside. I work for the deans. Oh no! Oh. And now I have. Uh, to uh, now we have union. to kill the okay, deans. Like, yeah. that's, 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 not, that's not good. That's not. Yeah. I, I, I mean, I, 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 I mean, I sure, surely. Uh, Wait, I actually don't recognize you. Who are you? And um, this 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 person's pointing toward uh, Salamander Gusser. Oh, oh, my no. brother, my comrade <laughs> in work. Let us have a conversation, oh, no. my friend. Um, I'm just like you, my man. I'm working. I'm putting in my time. I'm actually on vacation right now. I don't and... recognize your accent. Where, where, where are you from? Oh, I come from a faraway place. Well, actually, you might know it. Waterdeep. Fractals in Waterdeep? Yeah, there are all types in Waterdeep. It's a great place. Hmm. Okay. Well, I'm assuming if you're with them, you're on some official, are you on some official business or something? 
of course, we're always on official business. Actually, on behalf of the government of Waterdeep and the sort of um, interplay that has been occurring on our lands, we've come to have a conversation with these deans. This is zero deception. Someone has been using Waterdeep. We are the mask lords. It's all true. This is, no, no, no. You, yeah, yeah. you are telling the truth, though. So I would say that you not have to reply. It's that. not. I'll, I'll try. Like you, no, 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 no. You don't. Yeah. You don't. I mean, you you can try persuasion if you want. But uh, like, no, 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 no. I like you, you saying you, no. You, you, I, love, I, you, you, I mean, you are telling the truth. Like, you are straight up just saying what happened. So no, no, you're oh, right. shit, that's funny. Um, um. Okay. Well, uh, take your business. Um, the people are fractals and mm -hmm. frozen, and we would like to address that. Also, someone has been trafficking your students through our lands and that's not okay through the lands of what well i know that there have been experimenting with these uh with the tavern uh but uh trafficking that's yeah that's a that's, big word th th that's a strong accusation mm. do you have any evidence of that lorene lorene is frozen i'm all like that not like that <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> she 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 is um kind of like her mouth is agape and she's kind of like mm -hmm. just looking around like uh like she's kind of in in she's intimidated let's put it yeah, yeah, yeah. a lot for an underclassman yeah, sure, sure. yeah. Wow. so yeah. so so I don't think you're gonna get a lot out of her uh, yeah, fair you, but I do like the way I'll look to her yeah yeah you're you're a different uh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> No, you didn't want to let me intimidate nobody. <laughs> no, honestly, if this is where, as far as the conversation goes, without direct intimidation, run it now. Like, I, I, I like, we stated well, the grounds. We stated I mean, the we go a little farther. Yeah, yeah. I, yeah. I do want to know about these experiments that you you just mentioned. You've been experimenting with the the tavern in what way? Well, um, tra traditionally, we've uh, you know kept everything here on campus and. Uh, some uh, folks had the idea of expanding into other uh, towns, um, so they developed, uh, you know, a mechanism to do to to uh, do so. Mm -hmm. I'm assuming that that's how you. Uh, what, what's like uh, your name uh, uh, again? As he points to uh, to Gazrik. Salamander. Yeah, uh, Gazrik. Oh, Gazrik. okay. That's a very uncommon uh, actual name. Uh, where, where are are you? Usually, there are things yeah. like Jerry. Yeah, exactly. Uh, <laughs> wait, do I, you know Jerry? Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. We know Jerry. Yeah. You know yeah. Jerry? Yeah. 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 Good guy. Oh, Very funny. Very. Yeah, he's kind of, I don't know. Uh, Very experimental with some of his work. Yeah. Uh, Pushing boundaries. Okay, well, if you know Jerry, um, I think I could fit you in into the schedule. Uh, wait, wait, wait. Is Jerry like the king of the fractals or something? <laughs> this would explain a lot. It yeah. would actually. <laughs> Jerry's a good guy. Yeah, yeah Jerry, I mean, yeah. Jerry's a good guy. And like, he just tries really hard, you know? Mm -hmm. um, and like, he's he's actually out there experimenting while like most of us are just, you know, working here day and night. You know, like my cot is, you know, uh, I mean, it's a really good cot, but. Brother, yeah, when is the um, last time you got a vacation or a raise? Well, the vacations here are actually pretty cool. I just like uh, if you go down to like the lower floors, they have like some pretty cool, like um, foosball tables down it's there. On site, uh -oh. you go, you oh no, my oh. man, no, it, it, comrade, I've got some literature for you. We've got to spend some time, comrade. Hold on, I mean, is, is Trixie even a startup? <laughs> <laughs> I think it's been around long enough to be past the start. Of yeah, I yeah, know, yeah. but it's okay, come full think, circle. It is, right. it is also higher end, so yeah, true. Yeah, that's yeah. true. It's it's like in beta. It's, like mm. it's, oh, no. it's been in beta for six hundred years. <laughs> yeah, as yeah. someone who worked in higher ed, this is <laughs> exactly <laughs> correct. <laughs> um, uh, oh, yeah. so I don't cry. Yeah, um, I, I I think I could fit you in um, some time, maybe in uh, let's see, and just like flipping through parts um, in the in the uh, lip board and says, um, how does uh, next week at uh, around this time sound? No, 
about, how about now? Yeah. Now? I mean, as, as, as mentioned, it, it is a bit of an emergency situation. And, you know, I mean, I, I don't want to, I, I don't want to drop names any more than we already have, but <laughs> we are here because of Jerry. I'm so <sighs> No, but they're really busy, and if I interrupt them, they kind of fly off the handle. Uh, Just do the, then let us do it, and not you. I mean, for all intents well, and purposes. Well, then I'll get fired for, you know, let <clears throat> the people getting past me, and just, you just want to barge in there? Yeah. Yeah. yeah it, 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 it's kind of our thing. Okay, Elise, do you have anything to say? <laughs> okay, well, uh, we got to come up with some kind of story, <laughs> like, maybe you... <laughs> That's right. uh, I'll take your clipboard. Uh, I'll take you, like... I just grabbed the clipboard out of this fractal's hand. Oh. Uh, so, so while the fractal is like hemming and hawing, yeah, I, I actually, I just slowly take the clipboard and hand it back to Dahani. There you go. Hey. And then I stand over the fractal because how big is this fractal? Uh, it's like, uh, I'd say, uh, it's around uh, Gosric's normal size. Oh, so I really lean into this <laughs> fractal. I go, you have a choice. You could let us in and help save you all, or you could worry about me, and I'm worse than the deans. All right, yeah, you can roll persuasion or intimidation. Oh, you wanna... Wait, I got to know that. I don't know. Yeah, this this <laughs> was like try, try, trying to protect his. We did just job. threaten their job. I, okay. Yeah. <laughs> uh, job. I'm going to go with either because I've got a plus eight in both. Yep, nice. either one. Right, love Whatever it. Whatever one you want to, however you want to handle it. And I'm roll. You should be able to hear me rolling this dice because I'm rolling it on my desk. Yes, chunky. Yeah. Uh, that Don't is a twenty-four. Me. Okay, sweet. Well, which which one do you want to do? Per persuasion or intimidation? Hmm. Somebody roll a d six, and if it's if it's even, it'll be intimidation. If it's odd, it'll be persuasion. Ooh, persuasion. I oh, so fast. <laughs> nice. Dang it. I guess. Oh, sorry, it, it was yeah. a five. Yeah. <laughs> Good right, roll, too. Right. Use yeah. that one more often. So, like, uh, you, you can kind of see, like, the gears turning, um, you know, in, 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 the, uh, in the head of uh, our clipboard. Uh, well, actually, our non-clipboard, very yeah. back now. Um, and, 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 like, says, well, you are a, yeah, you do look like a pretty intimidating bunch. And, uh, and, you, and, and you do know Jerry. Um, what was your name, by the way, friend? We'll say we overpowered you on their way in. Uh, my name is Clippy. 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 Nope. Um, uh, okay. I'm out. No, I gotta go. Hey. No, sorry. Yeah. That's a common okay. name here. Oh that wow! Every, every every everyone just left. Uh, I thought you wanted to come in the. Room. I thought you wanted to enter, enter the, the room. No. Uh. <laughs> um. <laughs> Uh, I think Clippy is a fine name. I don't know why everyone's not too much. That's okay. I mean, you is, 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 is it common here? Is, uh, is it like is it is it culturally normal? Why are you asking me that? You're a fractal. Don't aren't you familiar with? Oh, okay. I see. I'm from Waterdeep. You, you haven't really been. You're 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 not really okay. Now it makes a lot. Do you know the concept of I'm diaspora? Because I think that might be what I'm experiencing <laughs> right now. <laughs> so, too deep. Wow. Too deep. We're getting wow. too deep. We're getting too deep. We're on a college campus. I'm oh, the fractal oh, diaspora. Come on. Oh, my God. The fractal diaspora. Oh. Too deep. Um, <laughs> but, um, but hey, this is why. This is why you play games with a diverse cast. It's great. Um, right. That's right. <laughs> um, yeah. Uh, all right. Uh, I have one way. I think I I can like uh, I can uh, sell this. Can you just just hand, just hand the clipboard back to me, please? Yeah, yeah. I'll, I'll give the clipboard back. Yeah. Why okay. don't you give them the clipboard? I think you can I mean, let us in, right? Yeah, I'm. I'm also very easily persuaded. <laughs> well, he asked. Yeah, yeah. If you remember right. that, yeah. he asked. Uh, that's why I gave it. <laughs> yeah. Oh, so, uh, so uh, Clippy takes the clipboard, and Clippy uh, bashes himself in the head uh, with said clipboard. <laughs> I break, regrets. I do. Break, breaking his glasses. Oh. Um, and then uh, really loudly says, "No, 
No, you cannot get in. I am Clippy, and I'm standing in front of my job. He yells. <laughs> and then he very uh, dramatically uh, falls to the ground. Um, very loudly, like almost jumps on the ground. Uh, so, so that it's like very, very, very loud. And then he looks at uh, y'all and winks. <laughs> okay. I think before we brush past this wonderful fractal, I'm going oh. to reach down and touch his glasses and mend them. Aww. Oh, sweet. Just uh, yeah, 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 you know, like, like I'm gonna, like, like I'm gonna, no, that's that's gonna break them again. But I'm just gonna, like, <laughs> I don't know. There's no way I can mend them, but make them look uh, broken still. But like, I know. Well, no, no, no. You, you can, you can slightly mend them so that they're like maybe. So they're they're not know. in two pieces, but they are whole and maybe a little twisted. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, th- I think it's fine. Sure. Yeah. yeah. So. Oh my goodness. So. So, so 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 he's on guard again very dramatically like the hand is oh, on the forehead I love it. you know we love him uh, dramatic. We, I can yeah. actually respect that yes yeah yeah, yeah. he's selling should, he's trying to sell it yeah. we should it. go in before i mean we don't want to waste this right yeah. Yeah, yeah we should capitalize on this yeah yeah, yeah. Which, or actually <laughs> okay. are we even in front of i which one yeah, what which uh, door to... do you want to go? Oh, because oh, I was—I thought we were in front of a specific door. But yeah, same. Did, did Clippy no, just no, stop no. us so, in the in the upper floor? Yeah, was like, what yeah. So, oh. yeah. So, so, so the doors are like right next to each other. He kind of like materialized in the middle of the doors, like that mm-hmm. part of the middle of the doors, and was asking about it. appointments for both of them because, like, if yeah. you know, as as a, a a reminder, it's, it's like a codeine kind of system, right? Mm-hmm. Like, cool. For each thing. Can I make a responsibility? That's just weird. No, well, there, I mean, we see what's happening. <laughs> uh, this is an example, kids, of sharing responsibility. As we're looking at the doors, is there anything? Can I make like a history check or something like thinking about the guards we dealt with? Or like, huh? is there any sort of uh, like, can I find some connection to see if there's one or versus the other? Like of their um, iconography or something? You mean? Yeah, 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 something like before oh. there, or like even like color palette, because it really feels like things are almost like di- uh, divided in here by like some sort of denomination of like I'm theoretical, I'm uh like uh, more practical. It just yeah. Mm-hmm. Oh, I see. Yeah. So like you're trying to see if the door, like basically what the differences are between the two doors to do doors, and if there. Like we we heard there were nondescript guards. They were just wearing very simple outfits, just like yes. that. And like if that is even an indication, just like if is that more practical okay. then as opposed to like theoretical like if there's anything that oh, I could watch. Sure. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah roll, roll investigation. Okay. Or like any any anyone can roll investigation if, if you're interested in something as well with the door, with clippy, with the rest mm-hmm. of the of nine the, of, of this circle. Mm-hmm. Other doors. Plus nine. Eighteen. 18. Okay. Um, yeah, as you like peer at the doors, they they look somewhat different. Uh, yeah. I won't say you don't see any similarities to the door and the and the guards from before. Mm-hmm. Um, but you do notice that the door with the uh K on it mm-hmm. um is a lot um is like like you 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 don't notice basically any right angles in the design. It's a lot more like free flowing oh, and like mm. curved. Where where whereas the uh, door with the like a uh, eye is 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 like a lot more like angular and like mm-hmm. there's like a lot of like corners and straight edges on it. So. Okay, well that sounds fractally. Or yeah, Let's go say hi to. Ibrahim, is that right? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Right. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Let's go that way. All right. All right. So the door's closed. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Uh, oh. Uh, I think I would instinctually make sure it's not going to blow up on us as best I can mm-hmm. before opening it. Uh. And guys, there's no oh. doorknob. Mm-hmm. So it's a push. It's a push. Is awful. It's a push. It has to be no pushed. Door Look, we, what are the rivals going to do? We made a dramatic. We made we made a very dramatic kind of scene of pushing past the guard. I really feel like we've got to. We we've got to. Uh, 
be some yeah. be aggressive with the momentum door. momentum like sell it sure. Sell sure. It. yeah yeah yeah, yeah. yeah. And, and like as you say that uh uh out of the corner of your eye everyone sees clippy on the ground mm-hmm. like kind of like you know like kind of like angling his head toward the door like uh don't waste my performance yeah yeah yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> absolutely absolutely the bafta world winning yeah um i oh. Open. We push. I, I push on it. I try. I try simply just pushing on it. Yeah. Can, no, no, no. I'm just pushing. It's just... It's true. We haven't done that. We should at least try. Trying to push Faye... on the door and all. Can Faye try something? Yeah. Well, Faye could try. Yeah. 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 Um, I'm trying to see what kind of artificery things she can do. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Because uh, there's no doorknob for Sleece to pull off. Nope, there's no door. Now. It's just I'm like de- a big, desperately disappointed. It's just like a big ornate door. Does pushing do anything? Oh, are 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 you are you gonna push on it? Well, let's. Uh, uh, you got uh, a little too excited about that, Masood. Yeah. You might want to hold back. I wait until <laughs> Faye. I think God's just like moving forward, and then like stop. Like someone stops him. That. Yeah. Uh, Faye's gonna do an Arcana check to see if there's any magical way to open the door. Yeah. Um. <laughs> hopefully these. And you're if not. Left. Let's just bang on. I said, and if not, let's just bang on it. We can yeah. be aggressively knocking. You know what I mean? Uh huh. Yeah, and you'll laugh because I'm using my Grey Warden dice. Yes. Uh, Faye got a thirteen. On okay. Arcana check. Um, Faye can tell that uh that these doors cannot be simply opened. Um, uh, she can't quite tell exactly the method that you would use to like, uh, do it. Um, but she could definitely tell that, um, these aren't like push and pull doors. Okay. Um, oh, she's just like, eh? yeah. Okay. Now I push. Okay. Um, yeah, as, as you uh, push, I mean, you kind of push with all your might um this thing is not budging yeah fair enough. um but i would like you to make a uh con save oh okay yeah so i'm medium a medium size now my I'm constitution okay as a fractal gives me a plus one so I roll <laughs> oh goodness it's better it's better no it's exactly the same it wouldn't have mattered <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. great d20 plus one or just a constitution saving throw, right? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Not, yep. Let's see. Who is a plant that was created or manipulated to impede movement? Because I got advantage on that. <laughs> is it a plant? Is it a plant? It's a wooden door. Is it a wooden door? I would say it's not a plant or plant based. It's not plant based. Okay. Oh, not a plant based door. Sorry. Well, your Very boy got a six. Though. Your boy, your oh, boy got goodness. a five plus one six. <laughs> Okay. Uh gosh, if you feel yourself being uh pulled um oh into this door. Well the six. Uh, uh, um, uh, I, I'm it's I'm pushing and it's it's pulling. Oh no. Everyone else sees Gosric slowly uh basically uh morphing into the door. And after a couple seconds, uh, you see a Salamander Gosric like inscription on the door. Oh dear. <laughs> like, is it just a picture or are there any words with it? Uh, it's like a three, it's like a three dimensional, uh, basically sculpture of Gosric in the door. Uh, I will say just for streaming purposes, Gosric, you can still talk. Uh, <laughs> So uh, that happened like uh, over 30 things. seconds, guys. That happened <laughs> over so long. I was a, such a slow transformation and we just watched. It's yeah. the last time. Yeah, yeah. The problem is it's last time you transformed yeah. and it was on purpose. So how are we to know? You didn't tell us then. Maybe you, okay. were, maybe you okay. were trying to really yeah. meet, you know, meld with like understand the door, get inside mm-hmm. the door's thoughts, mm-hmm. not yeah. just actually actively inside the door. Well, yeah. look at where we are now because you all assumed. Yep. Yeah, this, is, this, is, this is better now that you're in door actually. Oh, it did. <laughs> yeah. Well, we so can't... you can talk, but you can't move. Yeah, yeah, yeah absolutely. Yeah, you can't move. I don't. Oh, well, now we can't even knock on the door like we were going to. And I sort of take, like, I take my fist and like 
pound in the direction of the door, but I don't want to touch it. Gosswick, uh, I, I realize this is hardly mm. this is hard, hardly hardly a moment to ask something like this, but now, now that you're I uh, one with the <laughs> door, yeah. Do do you detect any way for us to open it? I, I, I realize that sounds terribly insensitive, but no, we're... no, 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 no. I get it. The ulterior motive of letting me get turned into the door. That's fine. We love this. Um, Is he give really... me a moment. I... Let me settle. Let me settle into the door. Be a door. <laughs> Be a door. Settle into it. <laughs> Be a door. People either push or pull. Always through, never at. Okay. Can I make an inside check now at, at the door? <laughs> Uh, why? Of course, yeah. of course, you can make a door inside check. <laughs> of course, uh, I will. Uh, uh, yeah, yeah, just just straight up check. <laughs> okay, cool. I'll take it with it's disadvantage. Like, uh, it, it's it's a kind of work. So I was like, is it advantage because you are the door, or, or is, is it, it disadvantage? So 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 yeah. We'll we'll we'll, we'll just say just a straight check. Okay, so okay. It, it was a ten. Plus eleven, so it was a twenty-one. Okay. Um, so you are. Oh, sorry. God, 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 God is one with this door. Yeah. Okay. Um, so you do feel that. Um, you know, there's definitely a way, not quite to open this, but that there would be a way to get the attention of whoever is in this room. Mm. Um, like for example, you feel as you sort of like as as you were settling in the door, you almost felt like as you shifted your weight mm -hmm. that the door was moving ever so slightly, mm. as you were like shifting your weight backwards as you were settling into the door. Okay. Um. So you okay. feel like be, being part of this door, um, almost gives you some control over it. Okay. Uh. I. I if there's a way to help prep yourself before the touching the door, do it. But I think I can help if anyone wants to try and opening it because it, it we'll do it together and we'll, we'll figure out what happens afterwards. That's a, it's very a, very rivals approach. Yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah. So I can so, still cast all my healing spells because a lot of them are verbal. So we're all, a lot of healing wow. powers. Funny, oh uh, it's yeah. funny. Uh, Do not so, trust a talking door. No. <laughs> so Kent is like, okay, but Kazrik, how? Well, we can't touch the door, like, right? We can't even knock on it. And right. as I as I say knock on it and do the gesture, once again, the words knock on it come out of my mouth visibly and form into a little uh, translucent hand, a mage hand, mm -hmm. uh, and follow my motions, but actually knock on the door. But since I wasn't expecting it to happen, I end up knocking on Gosrick's face. Yes, by right mistake with the <laughs> Oh, that, man, I, I wish I could draw. I really wish I could draw. So, so but I'm leaning um, into it. I'm, I'm letting the force. Yeah. Like a mage hand Good. knocking on Gosrick oh. as part of a door. Yeah. As a salamander. <laughs> as, as a salamander. A salamander. salamander. So just so many levels here. We, yeah. we, we, we got going on. Gotcha. Um, oh. Yeah. So um, mage hand is knocking on, on Gosrick. Gosrick yeah. is leaning back. Yeah. Uh, which is going to move the door a little bit for sure. Um, and I'll say now there's like a sliver of it that is open. Um, kind of a thin one. You could probably squeeze through if you wanted. Um, but you do hear a voice now um, saying, um, Clippy, is that you? I told you I didn't want to be disturbed. Um, Clippy is otherwise disposed at the moment. What? He's always here. Wait, are you Clippy's like replacement? Like, did did they promote some other Fracto up again? Can we just like get in the room at this point? You can try. It's it's like a pretty uh thin uh thing, but uh y'all can try to squeeze through if you like. Um, it would definitely be a roll. Um, to like no, I'm just thinking through. of like, can one of us like use something to push the door, not actually oh. touch it? <laughs> you can try. Yeah, <laughs> my can favorite. Try. My favorite to hear. Uh, <laughs> how how about how about um, 
No, we're not Clippy's replacements, though there seem to be lots and lots of those outside. Wait, did you come in from outside? Yeah. 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 Is that a problem or unusual or surprising? In any way? <laughs> I love that. Um, well, everyone should be frozen outside. Ah, um, okay. Well, at least we're being So I don't think you honest. came in from outside then. No. Or if, if you did, I must test you. No. Stop. Well, why don't you open this door and give us a real go for it, huh? It's just jiggling <laughs> just, back. I, I'm really, I'm like, I can't, so I'm frozen, right? So I can't yes, cast somatic frozen. components, oh, but no. I'm like, I'm you trying. cannot cast. I'm, yeah, I'm yeah, really, yeah, like, I'm like cast. doing everything for gust, and I like, I can't move my fingers. I was like, oh, it's so it's, all that's happening is uh, primal savagery, and my like nails grow really long in the door <laughs> and then shrink. <laughs> just go through all. Oh, oh, oh. Gonna ruin the finish is it's what incredible. that is. Yeah. <laughs> I was so prepared. Um, yeah, and then uh, you know you hear footsteps uh, oh, coming God. toward, and then the door uh, swings open, mm -hmm. um, and you see Ibrahim. Sure, is my Ibrahim. Yeah, what does um, Ibrahim look like? is an owlin, um, <gasps> so it's similar to Javanesh, mm -hmm. um, but a bit of an elderly owlin. Um, Even better. Um, you know, uh, but like the stereotypical uh, professor tweed uh, jacket with the uh, with the elbow patch is definitely going on yes. here. <laughs> um, you know, uh, some some uh, grayish hair as well. Um, a beer to rival Gosrick's uh, as Whoa. well. Oh. Um, I don't remember if you kept it as a fractal uh, Gosrick, but oh, uh, you do. yeah. But uh, yeah, it 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 definitely it de definitely rivals yours, Whoa. except it's uh, gray. Mm -hmm. um, and then uh, says uh, also notices uh, Clippy <laughs> uh, on the floor, um, who uh, is trying to sell it, but is also breathing really hard. So uh, <laughs> step in, in, uh, mm -hmm. doing a. Uh, Imagine it's real. Like I don't know if you guys have known any like stunt people or whatever. I imagine it's really hard to play dead like on a show because you have to like be completely motionless. Like you can't. Yeah. Yeah. It is like, very hard to, to play dead. Takes need to be short, and the camera yeah, needs so. to really know what they're like. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah. So. Um, so. so yeah, Every now so, and then he goes. <laughs> <laughs> yep. <laughs> yeah. So. Um, um, yeah, so so um, Ibrahim goes and like looks at the door, um, because he <laughs> noticed something that he didn't didn't see before. Yeah, yes, buddy, um, real rude of you. <laughs> and like uh, says, okay, so you don't have an appointment. No, you came from outside, so yep. just yep. Uh, just uh, come in so I can test you. Uh, can oh. you? I uh, can you just test? wait? For what? <laughs> though i mean if you're going to test us and you you know what's going on outside um i believe that you should remove our um our friend from the door because as you can see he's already a fractal so perhaps that might be um an advance on your on your testing but we should That's, probably remove him from the door yeah it's kind of interesting because you obviously have defractalized so you're no longer fractals but this one still stayed one yeah um yep yeah so yeah. he uh yeah so um ibrahim taps on the uh on on the door in like a sequence mm -hmm. um kind of kind of like um you you're like unlocking a phone you know you do those uh, <laughs> Yeah. Like, Can I try and memorize it? Yeah. yeah. Wow. Yeah. 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 Roll, roll, yeah. Roll. Uh, let's see what you roll. Either an intelligence or a. Uh, you know, I'd even say you can, even though you're not like remembering something, you can roll a history to sure. store it in your history. I will. <laughs> they're, 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 they're both, total five they're both the same. We're so, trying to figure oh. out what's going on with this weird. Thing going right. first, right. like that's. I'm reminding for some reason like this that. is like Diagon Alley energy it's when you're like tap, tapping on bricks. Uh, eight. Yeah. Yeah, um, just yeah, an eight. I, I mean, got a seventeen. Nice seventeen. Okay. Yeah. Um. 
to Hani, it goes a, a little too fast for you. <laughs> um, because like uh, you know, uh he is moving pretty fast. Mm-hmm. Um uh so at least you're able to catch a good chunk of it, not all of it though. Like not all of it. Complex look. I, I say that you're, you're like able, able to catch about 75% of it. So uh, I missed the final swipe or whatever. Yeah, exactly. The yeah. <laughs> or rushes in there. It's all good. Yeah. And then, uh, Gazric, uh, you uh, fall out of the door on your face, mm-hmm. basically. Um, and Abraham says, uh, wait, you definitely don't look like goes outside what what are you very interesting very interesting i think i might have to call kian in there because looks like you've possibly mutated from the other fractals that's 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 an excellent idea i I believe that um perhaps talking to both of you would be Yes. a great mm-hmm. thing right now it would be hugely beneficial what are you doing <laughs> i'm just like I'm, I'm walking around i'm, I'm moving again I'm, I'm scurrying on the ground if i had something to yeah. rest my belly on i would incorporate my feet as well but this uh, this is you're getting it you're, imagine my body is extending right here this is it yeah what what uh what size are you right now i'm a medium i'm medium okay. sized medium. oh yeah. my yeah. god he's huge excellent character work i gotta say <laughs> <laughs> a physical like, comedy <laughs> the shoulders up shoulders up, <laughs> <The> shoulders up. <laughs> um okay um yeah so um so uh, he uh walks over to uh the, the other k door mm-hmm. um and just able to open it he just like pushes on it and like mm-hmm. it's, it just this mother okay <laughs> it just opens oh. um now like you didn't try this door um mm-hmm. but it still seems strange Mm-hmm. that he's uh, able to do that yeah um and then uh you you know he he like opens it up just to call kian's name um and then uh kian uh come come comes up who is in that uh, elf um and she comes out and her hair is kind of like like frizzed out and yeah. like uh, she has what like looks like kind of like black smoke residue on her face here um, she's fun <laughs> and she like comes out like clearly i'm in the middle of an experiment why are you bothering me again abraham um and then uh abraham just like gestures toward everyone here Kian says well what uh, your students are turning into fractals and freezing and we thought we would help Oh, are you here to help with the testing? What? Okay, both of you have to explain mentioned. what this means. Right. We gotta we gotta start at the beginning. Okay, you're not here from the testing. Okay, fine. Um, yeah, wh- where are you here from? Because poor wait, Chippy? Clippy? Chippy? <laughs> oh my god, Chippy? she doesn't even no, know. Not even the name. name. No. 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 Yeah. <laughs> We need a different job. We we're going to bring it. Yeah, yeah. Um, and 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 the clippy on like of the ground says, uh, "I'm sorry, they were too strong." Uh, yeah. I, 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 actually, 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 yeah, clippy kind of like gets like uh, up and says, "I'm sorry, they were too strong," and then falls back. Yeah. Down. Yes. <laughs> oh yes. Yeah. <laughs> um. <laughs> Uh, uh yeah uh, uh for sure um and 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 then uh kian and uh and uh ibrahim just start arguing with each other okay like what are they uh, arguing about yeah about what though <laughs> yeah yeah and, and yeah they're just right in front of you so they're not like trying to you know try to kind be, of love them for that like a secretive about it they're, they're just like i told you too many test subjects at, at once and some of them might dematerialize you always throw caution into the wind well we can't just do one at a time like that would just be too like too like uh slow too slow look at this we have uh i forgot how how many rather we have this many uh, <laughs> there's, a, yeah. there's a lot of us to be fair <laughs> right, yeah. yeah yeah and and we have this weird i don't know what this is this is it's like not weird. Kind of a fractal, but not really a fractal 
like we de- well, like we definitely have to make sure that uh oh god oh god well look okay look. well hold on wait a minute wait a minute hi you two hello what Maybe. I actually both both yes. both both of them they have turned to you and say what at the same time Uh-oh. and then Dahani's like in surprise like fluffs up and she gets like feathers get all big like chill first of all wait chill what what does that mean are you trying to cast some kind of ice spell or something oh no they're booming no totally no stop <sighs> stop it please stop speaking for for. You guys are going to take everything literally. Please stop speaking. I have cold for resistance. Please stop speaking for 600 seconds. So hold on. When, when, who said I have cold resistance? Uh, that was uh, Kian. When Kian says that, oh my God, I almost said Latia. I pull out my, I, I draw my sword. Go, do you have steel resistance? Uh-huh. No, no, we're not. What happens in the hall? What? Oh okay, God. hold on. Everybody, stop. Stop it. You are a two foot nothing bird. She puffed I up. Am a, I'm I mean, the wingspan is there. The wingspan is impressive. Right. Yeah. All right. Uh, so please explain to us what this testing is. We are not a part of Strixhaven. We came from Waterdeep. Yeah. Why is everybody fractals? Mm-hmm. Yeah, those. Yes, those things. Okay. Well, I mean, you're here, so we might as well, uh, you know, whatever. Fine. Just answer that. Mm. Okay. So mm. we are conducting an experiment. It might be a little above you, um, but we're just trying to. Uh, we've been running low on mascots. Uh, we're trying to. We're trying to make some new ones. Um, don't worry. Everyone opted into this. It's a little extra credit project for everyone. So everyone's fine. I would like to make you, an I'm gonna let you check, finish, please. but yeah, please on that. Sure. Yeah. Everyone's yeah. making inside checks. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Everyone, everyone making sight checks. Well, never mind. That's a nine, so I'm out. Bye. <laughs> Faye saved us. She got a twenty six. Somewhere in those oh, terms perfect. and conditions, I'm sure. I got a twenty eight. Yeah, <laughs> I got a natural one as silly. No. <laughs> perfect. Okay. Yeah, yeah. So, so there's like definitely a mix of uh, yeah. of uh, stuff here. But um, for all the people that got ab- above a fifteen, mm-hmm. um, uh, they don't sound like they're lying. Um, they sound like they're definitely uh maybe stretching the truth, but they don't sound like they're outwardly lying. Um, okay. Um, well, we, no, we. Um, is, has Lorene regained any composure at all whatsoever? Uh, not really. Uh, you could try to, uh, you know, get her to, you know, you can kind of go up to her and try to, uh, um, try to get her to get back in it. But no, she's definitely been just, <laughs> she's never seen anything like this in her life. She saw what? someone morph into a door. Uh, she, there's just been all this yelling and screaming. <laughs> She's worried about her grades. The um, teens are suddenly here, both. Uh, <laughs> I'm, I'm, yeah, I mean, so we're uh, arguing with them, right? Yeah. 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 What, 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 I don't know. For 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 out of character, what what skill would you use to resist being intimidated? Wait, is it like a will check? Um, you could do there's like maybe a uh, to resist it. I would say like a charisma or wisdom save against yeah. it okay yeah really i'm smart like yeah we're yeah we're definitely we're, we're in a school so yeah Vir- virgil's going to kind of shake lorene on the shoulder but also cast enhance ability and and but, give her oh. advantage on on wisdom checks to essentially nice. snap out of being okay. dazzled will, by the I will, yeah nice uh, I, will, I will have her roll uh while she's rolling, advantage. um, I would like to say to the deans, okay, so I get the impression that the students did agree to be a part of an experiment. Did you tell them that you were going to turn them into fractals? Mm-hmm. How well, small was the print on terms and conditions? Well, we gave them a consent form, like they signed for everything. And uh, what does the? But what did the consent form say? Did the consent form say, "I student name consent to being turned into a fractal because Quandrix is low on mascots"? 
<laughs> oh, I mean, you can't just say it like that. That's of I mean, course like, you can't. So you tricked. <clears throat> I didn't. We did not trick anyone. Clearly, you're not familiar with legalese. Um, I can show you the form. Oh, oh. Uh, and, and uh, they uh, pull we all out, just smile. <laughs> they, they, they uh, pull out a form that they kind of have to unfurl. Um, and it does say, Dear student, on the top. Um, and then, like, it, it says, uh, Dear, like, uh, dear, like students of the Quandrick School of Drick Saban, mm. which is uh, located in multiple planes of like existence. Mm. Um, you, uh, me here, th therefore, thus, there's a whole bunch of uh, <laughs> oh, no. God immediately. It's like a contract legalese. That's my business. Um, and I, I just want to be pouring over it while they're continuing to talk. Like, that is. That's what I'm doing in this interaction to figure out Incredible. how to get these kids out of this like Hold on a terrible, second. terrible. So shit. did these guards go to poor Lorreen and try to bring her back because she didn't become a part of the experiment? Oh, I did completely forget about that. Yeah, the it was the first, yeah <laughs> we're now just mentioning the guards for the first time. Yeah, yeah. We, we don't have any guards here. It's a school. All right, let's take it back two or three steps. Are you aware <laughs> that there are a lot of student fractals temporally frozen underground? Right, we were on the ground floor. Sorry, campus. on campus. Let's start there. Well, that was part of our experiment, yes. Um, but as I said, they all signed our form and, uh, you know, they was able to you know, it's 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 just temporary. Uh, tempor I mean, until which, when? Which part? The fractal part or the frozen part? Good well, question. I'm I'm I mean, it's got to be both, right? I mean, like we uh, 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 hey, okay. uh, 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 again. There's a lot of equations that go into this. I don't want to go over uh, all the details. Hold on. So um, wait a minute. <laughs> wait a minute. So so wait. This dean is now also calling us unintelligent. Yeah. Just not initiated uh, into the mystery. They of are math. I wouldn't say they're calling you unintelligent, but they're definitely being condescending. <laughs> so, Celise would like yeah, to we... rage. No. Yes, please. And you see her just like this. This very John Wick calm settles over her. Like, hmm. well, there's work to do, and I guess it's that time. And she just leans into them because Celise is tall. Mm -hmm. So you lie to your students, you claim there's no guards, you froze them and made them all fractals for becoming a mascot. Is that what you're, is that what you're trying to say in a very condescending way to us? Look, students love the mascots, okay? And we're that, running that, really that well. That's not what I asked you. I don't care about students loving the mascots. It was a yes, no question. Surely you at your advanced stage know a yes, no question, correct? Yeah, the answer is a lot more complicated than yes or no, though. I don't care. I asked you a yes, no question. Do you or do you not understand that? Or must I explain the concept of a yes, no question? Get them! <laughs> yes, I'm like reading the contract. The I'm working on it, but this book. Ah. That would be funny. God, God, he, just, he just puts the contract down and goes, dang! <laughs> uh, I'll roll an investigation on this contract. Yeah, I got a 19 yeah. on it, but we, we, we can, that's later. Let's yeah, later. yeah, yeah. We'll, 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 we'll uh, handle things. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Um, yes, they, we are doing experiments, but this happens all the time here. This is not an uncommon thing. Is I'm sure most colleges do not turn all their students into creatures for the sake of a mascot. Ah, but most colleges are not strict saving. Uh, we push the boundaries here. True. <laughs> we push the boundaries here for knowledge. Oh, that sounds like a college that I used to want to go to until I learned better. <laughs> Was it strict saving? <laughs> no, my parents had taste. <clears throat> okay. Ah, uh, spoken like a uh, like a what? Don Strixer. Oh God! Now I need to look up a quick college in D and D to see where I went to school. Because <laughs> <laughs> Celise is educated. Oh yeah, yeah. No, everybody's uh, 
well, I, I mean, I don't know, formal education. Oh, if, no, she has a formal technology. education. She's a Sweet. smart paladin. Sweet. Um, yeah, yeah. Um, yeah, yeah. So as you're looking that up, uh, Gosberg, uh, what you see in this contract, yeah. um, you do see that it does mention that there, you know, that there may be experiments that might cause you to temporarily change form. Mm -hmm. um, this is like, way at the bottom yeah, yeah, yeah um and it's inside of a paragraph uh in like you know section five mm -hmm. uh you know uh s s subsection a mm -hmm. you know uh so it's uh you know yeah as, as, as you said before this is like terms of service right like yeah. they're burying this stuff in there and, and you immediately know i'm not gonna say because uh nimrod has done this but mm -hmm. you've seen uh, other people I, that might have done this so you are familiar with it absolutely um, gosrick pulls down the contract and says now you all are deans of a fantastic college and a great university of learning so i'm going to treat you with some intellect to do otherwise would be would be rude right a persuasive rival and intimidating rival. Love it. <laughs> Looking at this contract, going into it, and for it, like I literally lengthen my size so the contract can hit oh, the ground. That's awesome. That's like cool. as, it's, as it's going through. And then I lean over and say, here is where it is that you say you can transform students, like way down there. And here is where relevant conversation and context for that needs to begin for you to understand that this is intentionally misleading. This is, in, this is dubious business practices at best. You could lose your accreditation. What are you doing? And uh, they look at each other. Uh, he, 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 he says, well, Abraham, I told you we should have hired someone better to write these contracts. Uh, what are you talking about? This is, this is, we we is a perfectly fine uh, fine like uh, age 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 agency. Well, clearly there's a problem with it if uh, this again okay. weird mutated okay. practical okay. You thing. Know what? Okay. This is okay. not, uh, Thank you both. And then they start yelling at each other. <laughs> oh, here we go. I just pushed them apart. Like I just literally pushed <laughs> there them you apart. Go. Yeah. Okay. Enough. Okay. <sighs> so in the, in the end, uh, we this actually. I think I'm beginning to understand is only a part of the problem. In addition to this, which is not okay. There were also, again, connected to your college, as far as we can tell, students being kidnapped and, and taken and held by armed guards who were using the same transportational magic that Quandrix or Strixhaven as a whole has used to uh, connect the campus to other places. What do you know about that? Okay, armed guards? Yes. In Strixhaven, I, mm. that's something that's never, never been allowed. Technically, the school of knowledge. Technically, the armed guards were in water deep, but they were using the teleportation magic that the Bows and Tavern employs to thank you kidnap nice. students. See, this Modifying is why we didn't... wizard gizzard. See, this <laughs> is why that this is why. <laughs> See, this is why this expansion thing is so risky. Like yeah. now. Oh. Now, now y'all are bringing weapons into our campus. Like we should have, we 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 we, we should have remained to ourselves. Wait. So you're uh, aware? You're aware of the expansion idea? Well, it's everywhere around the campus. Everyone has a view on it. Okay. I would love to know if there is anyone else on campus at your level of esteem who was strongly in favor of this expansion plan. Uh, let me think, let me think, let me think. Uh, well, if you could make it over to Prismari, mm. um, I can definitely tell you that like Nasari for sure was in favor of this. Um, and mm. 
a Vilda probably as well. I'm not sure, but mm. definitely Nasari. Those are both the those are the two Prismari deans. Yes. Okay. Mm-hmm. And the whole Strixhaven tour. I love I, know, it. I, love it. I love it. Um we sorry, this is a little we're pulling from before and bringing it back. You said that you were low on mascots. Yeah. Yeah. Why? Well, um, Ever since Tenzir, um, uh-huh. you know, who, do, do you guys know who Tenzir is? Uh-huh. Yeah, we know yeah. Jerry. <laughs> oh, you know Jerry? <laughs> yeah, there we know Jerry. Is. There it is. Yeah. Okay, well, I'm sure he told you all about his quest to find Tenzir and read all that. Very kind ambitious, of stuff. Fractal. Uh, yeah, well, ever, yeah, ever since Tenzir, uh, you know, uh, I don't want to say disappeared one of our great founding dragons, but just has not been as accessible. Um, you know, a lot of fractals have kind of gone off uh, looking for, you know, trying to, fu- trying to figure it out mm. um, because, you know, they represent this school. Um, Jerry's been leading it up, but uh, there's definitely been a lot of them and we just haven't had a lot here. And, uh, you know, it's just kind of changed the campus. Like mm. students without their fractals are not a happy bunch. Okay. So, if we can, because it all feels connected in some way. Don't ask me why we've been doing this for a while. If we can figure out where Tanzir is and hopefully encourage the fractals to return, will you please stop turning students into mascots? Well, it's temporary. Um, Actually, but I, I have guess, a question about I guess, that. Saying temporary. I guess we could make an amendment to uh, the contract mm-hmm. uh, way at the bottom. Uh, I do have a question about that, though. You say it's temporary, um, but our wonderful friend Gosrick here did cast Greater Restoration on one of your fractal students, and it worked, but then they became a fractal again. Yeah. So you say oh, well, it's temporary, and magic like that should be able to stop a thing like that. Mm-hmm. Well, temporary for our magic. I mean, clearly. Oh, uh, you should stop speaking is, now. Is, 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 is that the weird salamander <laughs> one? That, um, that's yeah. my name. Uh, I mean, what'd you cast? Like some measly, you know, I mean, we, 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 we've been doing this for a while. Uh, our mm-hmm. magic surely. Uh, oh, that's what? You know, it's a little better than that one. So, uh, I while they're saying it, I cast um, while holding the contract, yeah, contract. Um, I cast Flame Blade <laughs> and just make a, a, a flame blade appear in my hand, burning the contract at the same time. Um, uh, okay, okay, uh, do you yes. say anything or just silently? silently yeah, and they're judging me for my magic. Nothing. Yeah. I say nothing. I just burn okay. their work and stand there with contact, a flaming like... sword. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> Still in okay. salamander form. Okay. Oh, I mean, of course. Yeah. Um. Okay. Yeah. So, like, uh, you're just so- silently burning this again. Uh, you know, I don't think you gave anybody any warning. Um, but you know, you're just doing that. Mm-hmm. Um, and there and uh. Once again, uh, Anna and, and Abraham start arguing oh, um, All right. about uh, how they're going to create a new contract. And that's where we're going to end. Uh, no. <laughs> What's going to do a thing when you're yes. bickering? Yes. Yes. I love a cliffhanger. I love it. <laughs> no. What's going to Just... do a thing? <laughs> Uh, uh, is it a Write quick it down. thing? Is it a quick thing? Is it? A uh, thing? Well, I was gonna try to calm emotions. Uh, oh. Yeah, 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 yeah. Maybe, maybe we can end with it being calmer. So, yeah, yeah, you can, you, you can do that. So. Um, well, all they have to do is um, charisma saving throw, but they have to hit a sixteen. Okay. All right. Yeah. 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 yeah let's uh, end. Let's end with that. So, so, uh, two, what happens nope. when we cast a spell on them? Oh, one of them gets a six. Uh, nope. Oh. The other one got a three. <laughs> Incredible. Nope. Even, even even with their bonuses, that hasn't that hasn't rise up to there. So nice. Uh, so no, they're uh, do a little feisty. Um. So if you have any questions for our characters, uh, NPCs, anyone, make sure to put question in the chat. 
um, and, and then your question. Um, and we will get to them. The ones that we don't get to, we may get to in our after show or other stuff as well. Um, so uh, while you are gathering questions, uh, we will go through our outros. Mm-hmm. Um, but we talk about other things that we're doing, the things that we are involved with and cool stuff like that. So let's start with, in reverse order, Tanya. Uh, hey, so this week coming up, I'm actually going to Amsterdam. I will be at TwitchCon EU, and I am streaming from the Sega booth, Humankind. It will be ungodly early or like 8 a.m. Chicago time. So if you catch it, great. If not, no worries. Um, I will not be on Black Dice, obviously. But I can finally talk about I'm going to be on Good at Stuff over on Crown Channel July 26th. I'll be going out to Seattle. It will be live. And we're going to play with dice and see what we can make with a bunch of dice that I've made. Who knows? Very cool. Um, Yeah, but big thing is TwitchCon EU. I'll be there. Black Dice is still going on, though, and we had a lot of great times to so go over and check them out. And everyone here will be here next week. I just will be missing. So, Celise calmed everybody and dipped out. She's done. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Eugenio. Oh, I'm unmuted. All right, great. Hi, everybody. Uh, I'm Eugenio, uh, DM Jesse Hins. You can follow me here on Twitch and on Twitter at DM Jesse Hins. Uh, what is going on? I'm finally back to a more regular schedule. So Tuesdays and Thursdays, uh, I stream on my channel. Tuesdays, uh, my partner and I are playing through, we're finishing up It Takes Two and then starting Portal 2, which will be a lot of us uh, yeah. killing each other with portals. It's going to be great. Portal 2, yeah. Great, oh, the great great Portal game. 2. Yeah, great yeah. phenomenal. Yeah, yeah it's going to be fun. Uh, and then on Thursdays, we go around and scream during Elden Ring. It's great fun. Yeah. Uh, I have a... <laughs> Talking about the thing. Uh, yes, I will. Yeah. I will. I will. Uh, Wednesdays, uh, we release episodes of my D&D podcast called The Last Refuge. We're about to, I'm actually about to bounce and record uh, the end of season nine. We got one yeah. more season left. So lots of, lots of content to catch up on there. Uh, and then I'll be back next Sunday with these folks. Um, also, uh, on Friday, so two days ago, uh, a video was released of me running an adventure from the upcoming Journeys Through the Radiant Citadels, uh, Mario Ortegon's um, fourth level adventure called The Fiend Apollo Mine. Ooh. I had some awesome players, uh, including Matt Mercer and Robbie Damon and Michael Galvis, Amy Dolan, and uh, Anjali Bamani. And it was awesome and a great time. It's such a great adventure. Mario has created such a beautiful world. That whole book is really exciting. Uh, the book comes yeah. out on the 19th, but you can go to DMD Beyond's YouTube page uh, and check out our video of Fiend of Hollow Mine that premiered on Friday. Uh, so I think we have a link in chat for you all right now. Cool, cool, cool. Yeah. In the Broadway, right? The Broadway. Uh... Oh, right. Yes. Oh, and, yeah. another, and also, it was a big week. Uh, also, I have announced uh, that in the fall, uh, we don't have an exact date yet, but sometime this fall, we're going to start dropping episodes of a new podcast, new D&D actual play podcast called Broadway Does D&D. Uh, I'm the DM for that, and I am DMing uh, Broadway stars Anthony Rapp, Lashans, Miss Peppermint, and Nick Walker. Um, of course, they all also do TV and film, so you may know them from all sorts of things. Mm-hmm. Uh, but we're gonna we're gonna start a new AP podcast, very dragon focused. Uh, we have their characters. We've done a session zero, session point five, uh, and I'm I'm really excited. Is they have everyone really bard? Ideas. Does everyone? Uh, is everyone? No. Okay. There's okay, only okay. one bard. Uh, okay. And okay, okay. she's as far from. <laughs> I don't want to spoil it because her bard like performance is quite unique. Uh, okay. But it is not singing or dancing or acting. So <laughs> we love her. Great. Wow. Awesome. Awesome. Hell yeah. Brian. Hi, I have nothing near that cool happening uh, <laughs> at all, but I will be streaming on my channel on Tuesday. Yeah. Um, we've looked at a few demos and a few stories lately. Uh, we may return to a lovely visual novel called The Hayseed Night. Mm-hmm. And on Friday, I'm going to be over at uh, twitch.tv, the underscore French underscore Tuck at about, I believe, 6.30 p.m. Eastern. We're going to be doing a uh, Hades homebrew inspired uh, D&D one shot. There is no Ooh. escape. We're going to play shades trying to uh, shades and elysium trying to escape to the upper world uh the french talk will be dming myself awkwardish panda dimples and dice and lonzo gonzo oh, sounds and cool. uh sounds like then so fun. let's see i don't know i'm trying to trying to think nothing else no uh yeah next weekend is is just my normal morning streams and then i'll be back here on sunday awesome i'm awesome good stuff see ya Oh wait, wait. So sorry. I, I, <laughs> it's okay. I, it's really sorry, cool. I, I like. I, I, get my suit, my bad. No, 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 no. Well, I, it's honestly, it'll be pretty short. Hey, I'm a suit. You can find me on Instagram and Twitter at Marudboy, M A H R U D B O I. 
Um, I uh, have a, on Friday, we did the show. Um, There's a collaboration between me and my buddy Tom, who's a chef at a, a bunch of great restaurants in Chicago. He made uh, food inspired by a bunch of comed- South Asian comedians. Um, we did storytelling. It was great. Been working on that show for a while. And can I tell you what? I'm just doing nothing right now. I'm taking it slow because your boy needs to. Um, so you won't really be able to, I'll be tweeting stuff. I'll be doing some other things. I'll be here with the rivals every Sunday, having a blast. Um, what's it called? Uh, Stool Pigeons also just finished their first season. You can uh, currently catch them on the I Need Diverse Games Twitch channel. Watch our previous uh, episodes if you want to get caught up there. Um, and uh, the next big thing for me that I have coming up um, is Gen Con. We'll be doing a Gen Con in a few months and we can talk about, well, actually less than a month now. Yikes. Um, we'll be talking a lot about that soon, um, but I'll be GMing for that and just putting things together. So keep an eye on that. And uh, if you're going to Gen Con, come to our show. We'll have a blast. Yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah. Awesome. Now, Latia. Now me. And I've stopped eating so that I can actually say yeah. things. Mm-hmm. Um, <laughs> Uh, I am the complete opposite of God, uh, Gosrick. I'm the complete opposite of Masood. I am so busy and I can't talk about any of it. Yeah. But, oh, uh, we love that. Yeah. <laughs> but uh, you can catch me next week at San Diego Comic Con. Uh, if you're going to be there, come and say hi. I'm doing some panels. I'm doing a live show that I think I can talk about. It's on the schedule. I just haven't put up the fancy graphic for it yet. Um, as you all know, I am the Community Relations Coordinator at Monica Games. I'm running a Title Blades, a Cypher System Title Blades little one-shot with um, B. Dave Walters, uh, Marquia McCarty, uh, Johnny Stanton, Jason Charles Miller, and one more person. See, this is, I tr- I did it too today, one but I tried not person. to because I, I tried not to list cast because I do this. If I don't yeah. have the list, if I don't have the list in front of me, I never get it right. <laughs> And no matter no matter what order I go in, I'm always going to forget one person. <laughs> that fifth person is Sage Ryan. So there, there it is. Uh, so that'll be on Friday the 22nd at 4:30 Pacific in the Omni Hotel Ballroom Four. Um, I'll have a graphic up this week once someone tells me that I can do it. But we're <laughs> uh, we're a week away from the convention. I think I can yeah. talk about it. Okay. Um, I'm also doing a couple of other panels. Go to go to the website, look up the look up my name, and you'll see what I'm doing. Um, which is wild. It's my first San Diego Comic Con, and so I'm really Yay. excited to, to be there and doing all that fun stuff. Have fun. Um, and then yes, two weeks after that is Gen Con. Come see us. Uh, come see me. I'll be working. Uh, all that fun stuff. But mm-hmm. anything else that I do or announce, you can find at my website or on Twitter. Both of them are latiajakis.com or add an at before it. Mm-hmm. Sweet, sweet, sweet. All right. Uh, and I'm Sharif, I've been your DM. Um, no other games going on for me, just working, daddying, and uh, all that uh, good stuff, taking up my time. Um, so let's try to hit up some of these questions uh, mm-hmm. before we get out of here. Uh, first question for Clippy uh, <laughs> How often do you help the deans write a letter? Uh, Define help. I mean, I pretty much write all the copy, all the meeting invites, organize all that stuff. Um, I mean, sometimes they'll dictate what they want to me and I'll try to capture it, which is really weird because they're like, they know all this magic. You think they yeah. could just like dictate a message or, or I think there's a spell called message they can use to contact people as well. Um, but they kind of like the old school thing, you know, so I, I, uh, I write a lot of their stuff. Uh, question for Gazarik: Will you be attempting to get comfortable inside the next door you find, or is this a one-time thing? I think this is a one-time thing. Um, frankly, because doors and, and, and really uh, worth considering. I only shape shift and become uh, non animate objects, <laughs> animate things with some sort of life force inside them um inanimate things maybe with a life force can be a further exploration but as of right now oh. one time all right and, and also can you summon skippy while you're in the door I was no, no cannot no can't cast, it, but... <laughs> yeah, can't, can't cast somatic or uh material yeah. components yeah uh question for kent what words would you like to leave hanging in the air over the dean's heads i would love to make to like just yell shut up and cast silence on the two of them. I don't unfortunately have that spell, but if I did, that would be next. Yeah. 
Yeah. This is also funny because if if if, I, if, <laughs> if, if if I read right with how you're playing the character, uh-huh. these spells are always accidental. So you can't like plan it. They so just far they have been. <laughs> they just, yeah. They just happen. <laughs> Eventually, maybe he'll figure out how to, but at the moment, yeah, they just sort of happen. <laughs> yeah. Uh, question for Solis What did Fen think of flying? You, if they mean Fenris, he was like, eh, this isn't bad, except he did like gently chomp onto Solis's coat so he didn't fly away. Because he was like, ah, what's happening? Mm-hmm. Okay, my human is all right. And then just did like the, right. you know, like when it's dogs are playing. <laughs> Like the little chomp just to not yeah. fly away. I just, I just imagine also like a dog on a road trip in a window, like chomping at the air, rushing by as we're going yeah. up. Like <laughs> that could be it too. That's yeah. cute. Yeah. Fantastic. Um oh well, that's it for questions. Yeah, we got through um, them all. Thank you. Any final words, anyone? No, check out the Patreon because we're gonna go record well, I'm not, but the that's rest it. of them are going to up shop. Yeah, yeah, no, you check out the you leave. I, I, you're done. You're right. Right. 86 <laughs> Daniel, everybody. <laughs> Um, yeah, yeah, we are exactly. actually about to hop off um, to record our after show for this episode, which if you are a Patreon supporter at the $10 tier and higher, you will have access to this week. Mm-hmm. Yeah, absolutely. So uh, have a uh, gr- great week, everybody, and we'll see you next Sunday, everybody. Peace Thanks. out. We're going to go yeah. raid, raid. We're gonna go yes. raid yeah. uh, the Opera Geek. Oh, yes. yep. raiding. We are raiding. So give all the rivals you. love to her. Yeah, we got to stop telling people to like buy. Like, don't go like, anywhere. No, no, no. <laughs> Yeah, leave, goodbye stay. from us, but stay. Leave from yeah. us, stay. <laughs> stay for our one. friends. Yeah. Um, All right. Yeah. So uh, uh, send the Ray love over, over to Kelly. Peace. Thanks, y'all. See you next See week. See y'all next week. Bye. <laughs> <laughs>